Yanis Varoufakis delivered a bitter swipe at EU leaders after the European Central Bank pledged to keep interest rates at record lows for even longer. Christine Lagarde unveiled new policy guidance on Thursday that hints at even longer support for the bloc's struggling Eurozone economy, in line with its recent commitment to boost inflation that has undershot the ECB's 2% target for nearly a decade, unveiling a new strategy and a tweaked inflation target just two weeks ago. The ECB said that long periods of low inflation would require especially forceful or persistent policy support, a hint that stimulus might be kept in place for longer than many had predicted. The ECB said it expects rates to remain at the present or lower levels until it sees inflation reaching its 2% target well ahead of the end of its projection horizon and durably for the rest of the projection horizon. It also said progress in raising underlying inflation should be sufficiently advanced to be consistent with inflation stabilizing at 2% over the medium term. This may also imply a transitory period in which inflation is moderately above target, the ECB said in a statement, but the announcement was lambasted by former Greek finance minister Yanis Varoufakis who claimed the strategy aims merely at keeping oligarchs in power, as the euro area government debt reached up to 100% of GDP in the first quarter of 2021, he said, they continue to pretend to uphold to the ridiculous Maastricht rules, an insidious strategy of the EU's oligarchy to maintain its power to decide who can, who cannot, violate rules impossible to uphold. He added, notice how the ECB's predictions are not merely ridiculously wrong. No, it is worse, they are intentionally wrong, i.e. always predicting that the 2% target will be reached. The bank earlier promised interest rates would stay at the present or lower levels until the inflation outlook in its staff forecasts robustly converged to a level close to the target and underlying inflation dynamics were also showing such an upward trend.